Hey guys, this is Basant here and welcome back to SQL YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to compare two content repurposing tools. First one is the repurpose and the second tool I'm going to compare with is the Chopcast. So both are the very good content repurposing tools that you can use to con uh, convert your long form videos into reels, into shorts or Facebook square videos, LinkedIn videos or the Instagram videos. And that way you can multiply your one content into the multiple pieces. So both tools are pretty much very easy to use and in this video I am going to compare and give you the full details and what are the aspects that are the different in both platforms. So without wasting any more time let's get started. So I am going to start with the both platforms UI then I will give you the all the features demo. I will also show you how you can import your or link out your uh, platforms to repurpose your content and in the end I will talk about their pricings and if there are any lifetime deal available or not so let's get started so let's start with the, the uh, both tools UI so you can see this is the repurpose.io repurpose is the very popular tool in the content repurposing uh, uh, industry and you can find this tool very easy to use and very easy to understand you can see it has the all the major options available on the left side of the menu and basically they are the two major uh things available first one is the workflow and second one is the connections okay so i will give you the full details on these options available but in this uh, uh comparison i am just comparing the ui now let's compare it with the chop card so chop card is really really easy you cannot find out any of the uh, menu side options available because this tool is only uh, options gives you to upload or uh, fetch the video from your youtube channel and after that it will turn that videos into the multiple clips and this all the things going to be uh, uh, happen in the uh, automation so you don't have to do the anything manually and everything that uh, this uh, tool converted from your long youtube video into the short clips comes with the uh, very detailed editing from here you can see automatically the subtitles added and from here you can even uh, correct the misspelled text here okay and after that you can see here you uh, from this thing you can even uh convert the size on repurpose the content so basically that is the thing you can do here. for example uh, if i go back from here you can see this is the uh, five minutes video but chopcast is automatically chopped these videos into the multiple short content pieces like the 48 seconds 46 seconds 45 seconds okay so this thing uh, automatically happen in the chopcast and this is the only thing chopcast do there is no uh, manual things workflow uh, happen and this there is no automations uh, creations you can do like the repurpose okay so this is basically the ui difference you can find out and the major difference in the repurpose and the chopcast now let me show you all the features in both platforms basically chopcast has the only features that i have just showed you but with the, but with the detail editing and the control over the text over the uh, content form and over the uh, content repurpose format okay but in the uh, if i go to the repurpose.io let me show you all of the features so first one is the uh, workflows from here you can uh, create the workflows that will work on the automations like for example you can see i have already created a workflow here in which I my YouTube video is automatically turning into the short clips and after that it will be published on my TikTok account so this is the automation I have created and I, if I give you a glimpse or example here let me also give you that so if I click here view, view content okay and let me show you so this is the my YouTube video and let me show you how it's going to look like once it's going to be published on the TikTok account so let me click on the settings so this is how it's going to look like here's my uh, uh, headline will appear this is the subtitle that is that's again automatically generated in uh, the purpose too and from here i can even control the background uh, uh, color here the text color and the subtitles colors okay and and for example i cannot uh, i do not want to repurpose in the reels or the short formats you can see there's also the square format available see in this single click i have just formatted the video into the uh, facebook or the linkedin uh, square format and again in the single click i can even format it in the reels or the short formats or the tiktok uh, videos format okay so that's the simple thing and everything is going to be happen in the uh, uh, automation here and you can see this is the snippet clip snippet available means this is the five minutes video you can see here but this is the 55 seconds clip and let me show you how 
i can do that okay so this is the um, video from which i want to create the short clips and let me uh, uh, create another one and after that it will ask me from which point to which point i want to create a clip uh, for example yeah. see this time i have created this amount of a snippet okay you can manually customize these things and find out what are the major points that you want to show in your video see so now i have created the one more snippet and it is going to be published in my tiktok account in the short clip vertical format see now the video clip okay the uh, database is updating you can see now i have the two snippets available okay so this is the basically workflow will do now in the connection basically like the name is suggesting you have to establish the connection with the platforms you can see my youtube account is uh, connected my tiktok account is connected first one is the destination and second uh, one is the uh, 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 point where i want to uh, publish the first accounts content okay let me show you how you can create a con uh, connection here just click on add new connection and from here you can find out all basically all the major platforms like facebook linkedin tiktok uh, pinterest youtube accounts and if you are also doing the podcasts you can even connect your podca uh, podcast accounts here okay so connectivity is really easy just click on the uh, whatever the platform you want to connect after that it will if I, it will ask you to give the give name that connection let's connect here and after that it will open the prompt with all of your uh, accounts here and after that it will ask you to select the account and that's how you are going to connect your um, uh, accounts with the repurpose then there's also the pre uh, designed templates available that you can use for all of the uh, content formats let me show you this is the all the okay first i have to click on the predefined templates these are all the horizontal uh, templates available if i go to the vertical templates and click on the predefined you can see these are all the uh, vertical or uh, tiktok or the reels format uh, templates available they are really easy to customize basically you don't have to do anything all you have to just uh, uh, change the color of everything on this uh, showing here and after that it will add up this template and in between this template your video will appear see so that's the magic of the repurpose but if i compare it with the uh, shop cart there is no such things like the templates like the uh, uh, workflow or the connectivity options available the only thing you can do with the shop cart is you can convert your youtube video into the short clips like i saw, uh, showed you uh, earlier in the uh, starting of this comparison so this is the only thing you can do in the shop cart but basically our main purpose and the our main motive with the uh, repurpose or with the shop cart are turning uh, youtube videos or long form videos into the short clips uh, pre-designed for the reels youtube uh, youtube shorts or like the uh, facebook or the linkedin square video so the the both major thing happening in the both tools okay so that is the basically i am trying to say here okay and after that i want to compare the both tools uh, pricing because i have now compared their ui and the uh, features and in the both terms i can say here uh, the purpose is ahead in the uh, chop cast because you are getting tons of uh, automations and uh, connectivity options but if you want to simplicity and the only major uh, uh, result you want from the chop cut is to turning your uh, youtube videos into a short clip then i think chop cut is the pretty much good for you now let me compare the both tools pricing and see if there is lifetime plan uh, available or not let's start with the repurpose so this is the repurpose pricing uh, users also get the 14 days trials and publish 10 videos for free so this is the 14 days trial you can get with the repurpose and their pricing starts from the 15 dollars a month but let me show you the thing here this is just for the podcaster plans means if you want to do only the audio things then th this is the 15 dollar plan is for you but if you want to turn your long form videos or the long form content into the short form uh, reels type or the youtube short type or the facebook square type video then you have to choose their content marketer plan that pricing is the 25 dollars per month okay so you have to pay the 25 dollars for these all the features that i have just showed you 
and if you want to uh, offer the uh, freelancing services then you can consider buying their 125 agency plan this is the 125 monthly plan so this is the official pricing of the repurpose and you can connect up to the five accounts social media platforms account in the this content marketer plan okay now let me compare it with the chopcast pricing first of all chopcast pricing is also available with a lifetime deal if i go to the uh, app sumo here you can find the lifetime deal page link in the description of this video and here you can see the pricing is just 69 dollars one time payment and if i click here plans and features you can see create short for videos clips automatically find and turn key movements into the binge watch clips basically all the features that i have just showed you formatting resizing exporting download text uh, videos everything basically from here okay so you can see uh, you got the uh, tier 1 license plans starting from the 69 dollars and you can upload uh, up to the 180 uploads means let me show you what that thing is so if you go here this is the three minutes video and you can see once i uploaded this three minute video my three minutes credit is burned from this uh, limits of the minutes okay suppose you are going to upload the five minutes video then after the five minutes of up video is uploaded this limit will be 175 so basically this is the uh, upload limit i am talking about and after that you can see unlimited users exports and storage you get in the chop car so in the pricing and value giving uh, terms of uh, services i can say chop cost is better offering compared to the repurpose here but again that based on your uh, what are the uh, things you want the from the both tools so this is the whole comparison i have done between the uh, chop cost and the uh, repurpose here okay so basically if you want the overall automations just set up once and everything will be on the automation repurpose is very good for you but again you have to pay the monthly prices and you can see here the monthly price is not much that kind of the cheap you have to pay almost the 25 dollars per month just for the connecting five accounts okay but in the chop cards you can see the price in is really really affordable you have to just pay once and you are going to get lifetime access of the chop card with all the future plans and you don't need to connect anything any accounts at all because there is no connectivity options available you just have to upload your video and the uploading process is really easy just click on the upload video this option and from here first option is available to add or paste your youtube link and after that within the two or three minutes uh, it's your video will appear here and automatically clips will be turned from the your long video but suppose your video is not available on the youtube you can manually upload it from your device so that feature is also available and the all the uh, text and the subtitles will be automatically generated so basically our major uh, possibility thing is uh, this chop cast tool is doing pretty well okay so that's all for today's video if you want to check out both tools you can find the link in the description of this video and in my case chop cart is pretty uh, good for my usage affordability is really good i can just pay just uh, for one time and i can use it for the life time so if you want to check out again you can find the link in the description but if you want to put the things automation just set up once and everything is done repurpose is good for you so that's all for today's and i hope you find this video helpful and really useful then hit the like button subscribe my channel for more upcoming tools reviews comparisons and more things bye bye take care and i will see you in the next one